There are three things that make me incredibly proud that Europe hosts the European Synchrotron Radiation Facility. First, you are a beacon of excellent science. Second, you are a powerhouse of international scientific collaboration. And third, you have created an interdisciplinary hub where scientists of all disciplines come together to exchange their knowledge. But above all, and as someone once said, you are making the invisible visible. To all of you, congratulations on 30 years of success. Here is to 30 more. ESRF was an essential ingredient uh, of our work on the structure of the ribosome. The Nobel Prize was given to Ada Yonat, Tom Stites, and to me. And I should say, Ada and I made extensive use of ESRF. ESRF is the position, the place, the facility where we collected our best data. This is where we did our real science. I think when you have a large international facility, you can do things on a scale that is not possible by just one country. The ESRF, because it has been international, has brought together top scientists from different countries, and this has led to a lot of pioneering ideas. Being at DSRF means having the best tools and working with excellent scientists from all over the world in order to solve the main issues of our society, such as environment and health. This is the strength of DSRF, to welcome users from all over the world with their diversity in disciplines, gender, language and culture, and who all come here with the same aim, to push back the frontiers of science. At ESRF, you have always a new project, arriving all the time and the constant flow of the young scientists who come here to learn and discover something new. People at ESRF are like atoms who link to each other through the chemical bonds. We create the knowledge and we share the knowledge with each other. In 1988, ESRF made history with the first third-generation synchrotron light source. An European dream became reality. Today, the history continues with EBS, a new quantum leap in X-ray science. EBS will allow us to bring science into new domains and applications that we couldn't have imagined a few years ago. The ESRF is and will be leader in synchronous radiation science thanks to its governance and to its capacity to attract the best mind worldwide. And as long as X-rays will be needed, the ESRF will be there to supply the best service. Mm -hmm.